Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I have Sheikh Excel Master and I am your friend Faraz Sheikh. Today here with another exciting video where we are going to learn how to change the multiple file names and their folder names. This is a very simple trick my friends and I am sure you are going to enjoy it. So let us quickly see how are we going to do it. To extract the list of files and folders from the system, we are going to take the help of DOS command. All you need to do is open your DOS. I have already opened my DOS over here. You can open it by searching CMD or even you can write as DOS. This is my Windows Explorer where in C drive I have a folder which is F Shake Excel Master and it has certain files and folders. We would like to do the mass change of the files and folders. So all we need to do is go back to your DOS where we'll write CD space C drive. Once you are into your C drive, you'll mention DIR, where you'll extract the list of the directory CD F shake. And again, we'll extract the list of the directory. Now, whatever the files and folders are available in this directory, we would like to extract that. Here comes the magic, my friend. With the help of this DOS command, we are going to extract the list of file and the folder names. So here we go. PIR forward slash B greater than and you can give your file name list dot txt. Once you hit the enter, please watch this explorer window. As you can see, the list file has been generated. Once we have the list of our files and folders, we are going to import this file into this Excel file. I have already set the template over here and I will just maximize this window. So please follow these steps. Select data, get external data from text and select C drive, F shake Excel master and this list. Once we select import, it will open a text import wizard where we'll select delimited, next, again next and we will select finish. It will ask us to select the cell where we want to put the data so it has automatically selected A4 I will select OK that's OK for us now we need to set the new file names so we are going to write those new file names now we are done with changing the file name now we would like to convert this data into a table range and I have already covered in my previous video how to convert the data into table range. So you can have a look on that. So we'll select Control A, Control T. This is a shortcut to convert the data into a table range. My table has headers. Yes, it has headers. Okay. If you get this message, it's not an issue. You can just select Yes and it has converted our data into a table range. With the help of the concatenate function and the DOS command which is REN, we are going to change all these file names equals to concatenate quotes REN space quotes again double quotes comma select the original file name comma Select the quotes four times, comma, and again you'll put quotes and space. Next, again quotes four, comma, the new file name, comma, again four times, quotes. Close bracket enter excellent 
we have the list of all the files and the folders need to be renamed as a list once you have copied this back to your DOS keep a watch on this Windows Explorer now go back to your DOS and paste the formula by right clicking your mouse button excellent you must have seen the files and the folder names are changed now in dir cls dir wow we have the new file names and the folder name so this is a method my friends where you can easily change the files and the folder names i hope you guys you like this video so please push a like button subscribe to my channel share this video and a soft copy of this file will be available for free of download for training and education purpose on my facebook group page so signing off for the day your friend farash sheikh from f sheikh excel master see you soon